Hello my dear students. Welcome back to the lecture series of ICC 9th Maths. We started the chapter in Dices from Aris Agarwal, exercise 6. In the previous 3 videos, I completed the sum still question number 15. Today we are going to start from question number 16. My name is Arpita Banerjee and you are watching Arpita classes. Let's get started. So question number 16 is simplified. The first question is a to the power 7. I'll write it here. a to the power 7 into a to the power 4 into a to the power minus 6 into a to the power 0. So here we can see the bases are same. So powers we can add. So here we can write a to the power 7 plus 4 plus minus 6. I added the power of this 3 but we know that anything to the power 0 is 1. So a to the power 0 will be 1. So here we get a to the power 11 plus into minus is minus 6 into 1. Anything into 1 is that particular thing. So from here we are getting a to the power 5. So this is the answer for the first one. Let us see the second one. The second question is a to the power 4 by 3 divided by a to the power minus 2 by 3. So when we know that when bases are same and they are in division form we can subtract the power. So we can write it as a to the power 4 by 3 minus minus of 2 by 3. So 4 by 3 minus minus of 2 by 3 which will give me a to the power 4 by 3 minus into minus plus 2 by 3. So here I will take the LCM as 3. So in the numerator I get 4 plus 2. So it is a to the power 6 upon 3. So that is a to the power 2. So a squared is the answer for the second one. Let's start with the third question. Let me rough this part. Third question now. The third one is a to the power minus 1 plus b to the power minus 1 in bracket divided by a to the power minus 2 minus b to the power minus 2. So our first step is to make the exponents positive. So here I write a to the 1 upon a to the power 1. a to the power 1 is a only so I am just writing 1 upon a plus this is 1 upon b divided by 1 upon a square minus 1 upon b square. Now you all know since it is plus so we will take LCM AB so it will be B plus A this divided by here the LCM is A square B square so it is B square minus A square. So now we can write down b plus a upon ab in place of division we can put a multiplication and the second fraction will get reversed so we'll write a square b square divided by b square minus a square now we can see this is in the form of a square minus b square so we can write it as b uh, a plus b into a minus b we have a formula or identity for that. So I will write b plus a upon ab multiplication a square into b square. I will split it up b plus a into b minus a. Now we can see very clearly b plus a and b plus a will get cancelled. ab and this a square b square will get cancelled and we have ab here. So the answer is ab upon b minus a. So this is the final answer for question number 3. So question number 4 is a to the power minus 1 plus b to the power minus 1 divided by a b to the power minus 1. So first we will make the exponents positive. So it is a 1 upon a plus 1 upon b divided by 1 upon AB. Here we take LCM AB. So here we get B plus A divided by 1 upon AB. 
Now we will write the first fraction as it is b plus a upon ab. We put a multiplication sign in place of division and we reverse the second fraction. So it is ab upon 1. ab, ab gets cancelled. So we get b plus a. If you want, you can write it as a plus b. So that's the answer for the fourth question. Fifth one is a to the power minus 1 into b to the power minus 1 divided by a to the power minus 1 plus b to the power minus 1. So first we'll make the exponents positive. So it is 1 upon a into 1 upon b divided by 1 upon a plus 1 upon b. We keep this as 1 upon ab divided by here we take the LCM AB. So in the numerator we get B plus A. We will still keep the bracket. Now we will write the first fraction as it is. Put a multiplication sign in place of division and reverse the second fraction. So it is AB upon B plus A. This gets cancelled. So the answer is 1 upon B plus A. If you want you can write it as 1 upon A plus B. So that is the answer for the fifth question is the sixth question a plus b whole to the power minus 1 into a to the power minus 1 into b to the power minus 1 so this is a plus b whole to the power minus 1 so i write it as 1 upon a plus b it becomes 1 upon a plus b whole to the power 1 so whole to the power 1 means that only so i'm just writing 1 upon a plus b into this will be 1 upon a into 1 upon b. I am still keeping the bracket. So this is 1 upon a plus b into 1 upon ab. So now you can see nothing is getting cancelled. So we will multiply numerator with the numerator 1. Denominator with the denominator. So that is ab whole into a plus b. So that is the answer for the 6th question. Uh, yeah. a plus b plus c whole divided by a to the power minus 1 b to the power minus 1 plus b to the power minus 1 c to the power minus 1 plus c to the power minus 1 a to the power minus 1. So our first step is to make the exponents positive. So a plus b plus c I am keeping as it is. Here I will be writing 1 upon ab plus 1 upon bc plus 1 upon ca. So now the numerator I am keeping as it is a plus b plus c. I am taking LCM at the denominator and the LCM is a, b, c. So if that is the LCM, here we have c, here we have a and here we have b. So basically it is a plus b plus c divided by if I write it in the same manner that is a plus b plus c upon a b c. Now I will apply the rule of division. So I will write a plus b plus c then I put a multiplication sign and I reverse the denominator. So it will be a b c upon a plus b plus c. So you can see this and this gets cancelled. So the final answer is a b c. So with this sum we have completed the question number 16. Let us start with question number 17. So now we start with question number 17. The first part. The first part is x to the power a upon x to the power b. Whole to the power it is a plus b. x to the power b upon x to the power c. Whole to the power it is b plus c and x to the power c upon x to the power a whole to the power c plus a is equal to 1. This has to be proved. All these three questions we need to prove the left hand side is equal to 1. Okay. So let us take the left hand side. Left hand side. Now for this part we can see the bases are same powers. We can subtract because they are in division form. So we will just write a minus b. This I have written only for the bracket. Outside the bracket we have a plus b. Same thing here. It is x to the power b minus c. Outside the bracket we have b plus c. And same thing c minus a. Outside the bracket we have c plus a. 
So now this is a to the power m whole to the power n. That becomes a to the power m into n. So x to the power a minus b into a plus b. This is x to the power b minus c into b plus c. And this is x to the power c minus a into c plus a. Right? Now we can see this is a plus b into a minus b, which is your a square minus b square. So I write here a square minus b square into. Here it is x to the power b square minus c square. Same formula a plus b into a minus b. And here it is c square minus a square. Now again the bases are same. They are in multiplication form so we can add the powers. So we write x to the power a square minus b square plus b square minus c square plus c square minus a square. Now you see this a square and a square gets cancelled. b square, b square, c square and c square gets cancelled. That means it is x to the power 0. And anything to the power 0 is what? 1. So that is equal to your right hand side. So this way we have to do the other two sums also. X, upon, x to the power a upon x to the power b, this whole to the power 1 upon ab into x to the power b upon x to the power c, this whole to the power 1 upon bc into x to the power c upon x to the power a, this whole to the power 1 upon ca. And we have to prove this left hand side is equal to 1. So let us first do the same thing for the bracket that is x to the power a minus b. This whole thing whole to the power 1 upon AB is there. For this bracket it is B minus C and this whole to the power 1 upon BC. For this bracket C minus A and this whole to the power 1 upon CA. Now we will apply this, that property where A to the power M whole to the power L is equal to A to the power M into N. So this will be X to the power A minus B upon AB. This is X to the power B minus C upon BC. And this is x to the power c minus a upon c a. Now we can see the bases are seen. They are in multiplication form. So we can add the powers. So it will be x to the power a minus b upon a b plus b minus c upon b c plus c minus a upon c a. Now we have to take the LCM. We have to simplify this part. Okay, the way we do it normally, we have to simplify this part, but it has to be in the power. Don't write it with x down. Okay, it has to be always up. So x to the power, the LCM is here a, b, c. So here it will be c whole into a minus b plus. Here it will be a whole into b minus c plus. Here it will be b whole into c minus a. Okay, so now this will be equal to I am writing here x to the power, multiply this, it is ac minus bc plus ab minus ac plus bc minus ab, this whole thing divided by abc is there. Now we can see this ac will get cancelled with minus ac, minus bc and plus bc, ab and minus ab gets cancelled, so it is x to the power 0 upon abc. 0 upon anything is 0, so it is x to the power 0 and anything to the power 0 is 1. So that is your right hand side. Okay, I think you understood the concept. Here we are using some of the, uh, you know, concepts of algebraic expression. Okay, let us start with the, next. the third one. It is x to the power a upon x to the power b whole to the power a plus b minus c x to the power b upon x to the power c whole to the power b plus c minus a x to the power c upon x to the power a whole to the power c plus a minus b. This is a question. This is a left hand side. We have to prove that this is equal to 1. So again for the bracket we should write x to the power a plus a sorry x to the power a minus b sorry. For the bracket we write x to the power a minus b and this whole to the power a plus b minus c. Here we write x to the power b minus c and this whole to the power b plus c minus a. I did two, two steps together 
because now you by this time you understood because we have done this type of sums previously right right now also okay so this now just multiply x to the power this is a square plus ab minus ac minus ab minus b square plus bc this whole thing i multiplied okay similarly here i get x to the power b square plus bc minus ab minus bc minus c square plus ac this i got for this similarly the last part this one i multiply c square plus ac minus bc minus ac minus a square and plus ab okay so i multiplied all these things now so just see what is getting cancelled here here ab and ab gets cancelled so rest of the things are there so i write a square minus ac minus b square plus bc okay similarly into x to the power here what is getting cancelled only bc so it's to the power b square minus ab minus c square plus ac similarly here what is getting cancelled ac so it's c square minus bc minus a square plus ab now you have the basis same so powers we can add because they are in multiplication form so we'll add all the powers x to the power a square minus ac minus b square plus bc plus b square minus ab minus c square plus ac plus c square minus bc minus a square plus ab i just added all the powers now see what is getting cancelled your a square is getting cancelled with minus a square Minus AC is getting cancelled with plus AC, minus B square and plus B square, plus BC and uh, plus BC and minus BC here. Okay, minus AB and plus AB here, and minus C square and plus C square here. So everything gets cancelled, and we get x to the power zero. So anything to the power zero is one. That is your right hand side. so these sums are very 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 important and it needs a lot of focus lot of concentration to do it because there are signs and everything algebra expression you are getting on the power so do it nicely in the next video i'll be coming up with rest of the sums uh, uh maybe another two videos are required to complete this chapter thank you so much stay tuned if you feel these videos are beneficial to you please subscribe this channel and press the like button stay tuned